Hey everybody, I hope you're having a wonderful day and today my I wanted to do a demonstration of a product that I've really been loving and I've already got my hair pinned back so with these cute little flower clips if you can even see them I think my hair is covering them up. Anyway, the product I wanted to demo today is a fairly new product and let me see if that's crooked. Yeah, that's better. Okay, sorry about that. This is from one of my absolute favorite cosmetic lines. It's, it's It Cosmetics. And it's called Your Skin But Better CC Plus. Uh, it's color correcting full coverage cream plus anti-aging hydrating serum plus SPF 50 plus UVA, UVB broad spectrum and it's a physical sunscreen and it's chemical and filter free and paraben free and I have this in the color fair and it comes in this nice little tube and this is actually a pretty decent size it is 1.08 fluid ounces and um, and I've used this quite a bit I don't wear makeup every single day and I switch between mineral makeup like mineral foundations and regular foundation and uh, the CC cream like if I'm going to be out in the sun a good bit I love to wear this and my face I just basically I washed it and that's all I've really done I haven't done anything else because I wanted to show you what this does on its own and I've really been truly enjoying this um it's just it seems to be pretty it seems to stay on it says it's water resistant to if you're swimming or sweating and which is really great uh it does also say to reapply at least every two hours you know especially if you're out in the sun which i don't spend a lot of time in the sun because i don't want my skin to age and also I burn very very easily so anyway this is a it's a tube but it's also a pump and one thing I like about this is instead of having like the normal sunscreen smell it's actually to me it has like a faint um, fresh lime smell more than anything it's a very pleasant smell I have noticed that um, not necessarily on your face but like on your hands it does feel slightly um tacky at first but i've noticed that like when i wash my face i, I have to, usually have to use a makeup remover wipe to get it off because it doesn't just come off so you know you know that it's not going to come off easily especially if you're swimming at the pool or the beach or somewhere but anyway i just wanted to demonstrate this today and i have an it cosmetics uh, egg shaped sponge but stupid me left it in a bag after vacation and it mildewed so I'm gonna I'm waiting I've got to get a different type of sponge or something so basically I'm just using a normal makeup sponge and this is dampened and for me two pumps of this does my whole face one pump doesn't quite do it but two pumps is just plenty for me and I like to put it on the back of my hand Mm, and it smells really good. It is very citrusy. And let me try to figure out how to do this. I've never actually really done this on camera before. So this is all new to me. But basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to take it and I'm just going to kind of dab it around my face. Especially over my problem areas, which are my cheeks. And now I'm just going to blend it in. And you could use your fingers for this, which I have used. Um, I've you, you can use a brush. I just prefer a damp sponge. I just find that most foundation seems to go on best with a damp sponge. So as you can see, I'm actually getting pretty good coverage with just one coat of this. I 
And so that's just one layer right there. And you can see it, it really, in my skin, you know, it's very red through here. Um, you can see it really seems to have evened out some of that redness. And then you could always apply more. Let me apply a little bit more, see if we can get a little bit more coverage on the cheek area. And my cheeks are super flaming red today. And I almost, for my cheeks especially, I almost stipple it on. Because that, I mean, that seems to give you a little bit more coverage. I'm going to say for a CC cream, this is actually a, I think it's actually a pretty full coverage CC cream, really. And sometimes I will actually use this just as my foundation. I mean, it's not a complete full coverage, but it's, especially with adding the little bit extra, you can see that it really covered up. A lot of the uh, discoloration the redness in my skin which I really like I like the light smell and like right now this feels a little tiny bit tacky this does not but um, you can also you can put a foundation over this if you want to um, I always afterwards I always use some sort of setting spray which really helps to make it last even longer um, you can set it with a mineral foundation I mean, you could, you know, whatever you want to top it with. Sometimes I'll put like a Bare Minerals over it, or I'll actually use that Cosmetics O2 foundation on top of this. But overall, I find this to be a really good product with actually very good coverage. Because you saw how red my cheeks were before. But I think it has super coverage. It looks... I mean, it looks really natural. I'm looking to see if I can really tell. It looks, let me get up right in your face, but I think it looks pretty natural. And more than anything, it even my skin tone out. It's giving me sun protection and it smells nice. It, and also like with this, actually I put it on my eyelids as you probably saw. Which I, you know, with a lot of sunscreen and stuff, you can't do that because it's going to get in your eyes. And I haven't had any trouble with this getting in my eyes and making my eyes burn. So, overall, this is a fantastic CC cream. And, I mean, you can use it as a foundation even. I mean, it's just wonderful. And I can't say enough good things about this. Now, this, at the time, you could only get off QVC because it was new. And this is what it looks like up close. But I believe now you can also get it at itcosmetics.com. And I'm not sponsored. This is, you know, this is completely my opinion of this. And I just overall think this is an absolutely fabulous product. And I hope, but I just really highly recommend it. So I hope you subscribe for our future videos. I hope you enjoyed this. Please rate, comment. Um, I'd love to hear what you think about the CC creams or um, I've never really tried the BB creams, but let me know like if there are some other brands that you found to be really full coverage or if there are some brands even that um, are more brands to kind of avoid, you know, so Anyway, I give this product two thumbs up. It's fantastic. I can't say enough good things about it. Anyway, I will see you all in my next video, and I will talk to you soon. Bye.